Hi friends, welcome back. In today's self-care video, I want to show you how to use a neti pot. Stick around to the end and I'll show you how to make this DIY menthol nasal inhaler. You will need a neti pot, eight ounces of distilled or filtered warm water. If you must use city or well water, boil it for three minutes to sterilize and then let it cool before use. Non-iodized salt, I use a fine sea salt, baking soda, and tissues or a handkerchief. To make the saline solution, mix a half a teaspoon of sea salt and a quarter teaspoon of baking soda into eight ounces of warm water, and then stir it to dissolve. Begin by pouring half or four ounces of the saline solution into the neti pot. Hold the neti pot to the opening of your nostril. Tip your head and slowly pour the water into your nose. This may give you an uncomfortable feeling at first, like being underwater, but it helps if you keep your lips slightly parted and your tongue loosely resting on the roof of your mouth. Let the water flow in one nostril and out the opposite. Then blow any debris that remains. Switch sides using the remaining solution. You can finish by swabbing a little coconut oil inside your nostrils. The sinuses are cavities in your cheeks, forehead, and between your eyes. Healthy sinuses drain on their own, but when they're not working properly, mucus builds up and can cause congestion, making it difficult to breathe and even causing infection. Regular nasal rinsing can help reduce sinus buildup. Okay, that wasn't so bad, now was it? Another helpful tool to keep your sinuses clear is a nasal inhaler. This one is called a neti stick, and they're very easy to make. So let me show you how. You will need coconut oil, cotton balls, essential oils. I like to use menthol or mints, tweezers, and an empty lip balm tube that has been sanitized. Rip a cotton ball in half and saturate it in coconut oil. Squeeze out any excess. Twist the lip balm tube all the way down. Then stuff the cotton ball inside. Add several drops of essential oils. You want it to be strong, so be generous. Then stuff the dry half of the cotton ball on top. Cap and turn upside down to disperse the liquids. Use the nasal inhaler periodically throughout the day to keep your nasal passages feeling free and clear. To use, simply hold the tube close to your nose and inhale deeply. You can block one nostril at a time for greater influence. Thanks for joining me. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and share. Remember to subscribe for more simple living, practical DIY, and resilience building practices. I'll see you next time right here at Little Little Red Cottages.